If you checked out my last video, I covered the Heisen gaming portion, where Heisen made an update to 1103. In this video, I'm going to be covering the same update, but this time I'm going to be covering Dolby Vision. If you have the UAH or are thinking about buying the UAH, I have some great news. Heisen has fixed Adobe Vision. So what you're looking at right now is showing proof that Adobe Vision is fixed on the Heisen UAH. Now, if you remember in my previous review or previous unboxing, check that one out if you get a chance. I did mention that Adobe Vision wasn't working where you see a lot of elevated blacks where you see the black bars look washed out or the picture look unwatchable while watching Dolby Vision. So I had to switch the settings or force it to HDR10 where that was a better view compared to Dolby Vision. But now after the update of 1103, it looked like Heisen has fixed the Dolby Vision portion. And I went ahead and just showing the picture settings of what I have and showing a couple of screens and videos showing that Dolby Vision is actually working. For testing, I'm using the Apple 4K TV. What you're seeing right now is the Dolby Vision settings. If you remember in my previous videos for Dolby Vision, you are limited to what you could change in Dolby Vision picture settings. The only thing I was able to change was the local dimming. I switch it from medium to high. All other settings are default. Even the backlight I can't change. It shows that it's at 100 if anyone is curious. For some of the movie content, I am using Ghostbusters Afterlife, Bullet Train, Top Gun Maverick, and a little bit of Godzilla vs. Kong. So just to show that Dolby Vision is working as expected on the Apple TV 4K. And one thing I can say by looking at the picture, yeah, I said this before in the previous video on the gaming side what Heisen has updated. Heisen is listening and they're doing a really good job, especially making these type of updates. Even when I'm thinking about Sony, Samsung, those are other manufacturers, I think Heisen does a really good job as in taking feedback and listening to the consumers. And that's one thing that I can say about this TV and that manufacturer is they actually listen. So kudos to Heisen, especially coming up with this fix with Adobe Vision especially updating the gaming portion of it and looking at this compared to what it was previously is a 90 day difference and I'm very happy that Heisen is able to update this. So the question you need to ask yourself is should you download the latest firmware update? I would say absolutely. What Heisen has done with the Adobe Vision side and even the gaming portion which I mentioned in my previous video, Heisen has hit a home run with this one. And there's one thing that I could say, and I just mentioned this earlier in my uh, earlier in this video, is, is that this manufacturer, Heisen, is actually listening compared to Sony or Samsung. They may hear some of our issues that we have with the TV, but Heisen actually responds and do a very good job when it comes to listening to the customers and doing the fixes that they're supposed to fix. And that's one thing that I could say about Heisen, that that any other manufacturers besides LG, LG does a good job as well to listen to the customers. Heisen really listen and they do a fast job as in a quick turnaround time as in getting everything that they need to get fixed on here. But besides that, if you think about getting this TV or you're on the fence, just to let you know, Dolby Vision is working, especially for the price that is going there right now. I know when I purchased the TV, it was going for around $900. I think it's a little bit more now. I think it's close to $1,000 for a 65 inch. But just to let everyone know, Dolby Vision is fixed. So if you're on the fence of thinking about buying a UAH, or if you have the TV and haven't updated the firmware, just to let you know that this is something to think about. But let me know in the comments what everyone's thoughts are about the latest update. Did you download it? Does it change your mind about thinking about getting a Heisen UAH? Let me know in the comments. But just want to say thank you again for watching my video. Thank you for subscribing. It really means a lot to me. And I can't thank everyone enough for showing their support. And just want to say see you on the next video. All right. Take care, everyone. Bye.